Hi guys, today I'm just going to quickly look at a few ideas in the style of Robert Fripp. The key to the first couple of exercises is to start on an up stroke using alternate picking. Because I start on the upstroke, it makes playing these awkward intervals and awkward patterns quite easy. Up, down, up, down. Okay, so to get the patterns that I'm showing in this video, we're going to do some primary exercises. This is a variation of the first exercise. This time though I'll start with a down stroke. So it will be down, up, down. But I deliberately put in an extra note to get the down stroke so I can start the next phrase with an up stroke, which will be this phrase. And I repeat it, down a tone. Again, this will set me up for the upstroke here. So it will be down, up, down, up, down, up, down, to set me up for this upstroke that I need to play this complicated part or awkward part because it's too difficult with a downstroke. So it will be up, up, up. This next phrase is just pure alternate picking starting with the down stroke. This last idea is a little bit more complicated because it's chordal based. It's very reminiscent of um, Robert Fripp and Andy Summers in the Masked album and the Bewitched album. It's that sort of concept. So it's like... And it starts with a downstroke. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. That 
in itself is an exercise. Robert Fripp also does a lot of cross-picking. But that's a subject in itself, and um, that's something I'll look at in another video. Because the cross-picking um, is another aspect that you need to look at in a slightly different light, and I think if I put it all into this one video, it might well be I'm a bit confusing. Anyway, if this video is of any use to you, please smash the subscribe button, smash the like button, write a comment, click the notification button, and I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you for watching.